What's up guys, welcome back to uh, the next episode in my um, Road to 100 Million series. So last week we finally saw uh, a nice increase in liquid gold. And uh, luckily for me we're looking at the same thing this week. Um, so it's been another it's been another great week for profit essentially. Uh, and uh, yeah, well let's just dive right into the numbers. So, uh, well let's zoom in a little bit here. What are we looking at? We're looking at 24.2 million gold right now, uh, which is obviously fantastic. Um, that's uh, 1.6 million more than we had last week. So, um, so yeah, as you can see, the Draenor, a lot of uh, plus liquid gold on Draenor. Uh, not a lot of sales though, not a lot of sales. We're uh, down another million in sales. Um, I did slack a little bit this week, I'll admit, uh, a little bit more maybe than last week, but uh, the reset day mailbox are definitely getting smaller, and a a huge amount of the base legendaries are not selling for a profit, or, or not selling particularly well at all, so we'll see what I do um, at this point, this is, hopefully we can sustain it at about this level, but we'll see, we'll see. Um, at least a lot of the other realms are uh, bringing in some nice increases in, in gold and a, a lot of sales. Um, I've spent gold on some realms this week, including I, I bought a token this week because I ran out of game time on my second account. Uh, so that's about half of the gold spent here on a shoulder rib. But um, but yeah, it's looking good. It's looking good. I got a lot of good um, a lot of good stuff here where the sales are higher than average. Um, a lot of them, we have our three new realms, which brought in a decent chunk of sales on all of them. So um, so that's nice. Uh, and uh, this Doomhammer realm keeps being really, really good. Another uh, 200k plus uh, sales week. Um, so yeah, it's been, it's been great overall. Uh, we'll see, like my main realm domination is definitely growing even smaller, which is a little bit... Uh, well, now we're on the pace that I was planning initially to get about 60%. No, maybe it was lo as low as 40% on my main realm. I don't remember. Um, it's not that important. We're about a quarter of the way and it's speeding up. I do want to speed up, speed it up more, which is a little bit hard because uh, I've been selling some BOEs, but I don't find enough deals. So it's not a good enough market. Um, what I know I have to do this week is get more battle pets for my new realms, particularly for my Therodon and Emerald Dream. Uh, Twisting Nether is a super high pop realm, so it's not going to be one where I can sell battle pets uh, successfully at all. Um, one interesting note this week that I've been taking advantage, started taking advantage of, uh, is flipping Monolite Ore, um, which I talked about on stream. And then Mantheus made a video and now the price has gone up. Like we've actually changed the entire EU region price, hilariously enough. So the entire EU region price of <laughs> of Monolite Ore is already up 50% uh, since I talked about it on Thursday. So word travels fast when it does, uh, but there are still great flipping opportunities. And I, I think it can still move up even more. Uh, I did buy a couple of lovebirds as well this week, uh, spread out across my realms. But uh, yeah, I want to spend I want to spend more gold on battle pets uh, this week for sure. I think I want to focus a little bit more on the battle pet market. It's a great time for that market in general because we're moving into a a portion of the expansion where people are not as focused on end game markets, where they'll be doing they'll be filling out their cosmetics. So so that's one market I'll be focusing on. I'll probably also run some more shopping scans for Island Expedition gear, which has been fantastic. Um, so, um, so that's it. If we look at my days, I, I did slack a little bit this week. I skipped Tuesday, didn't do anything. Um, and then I didn't do anything on Friday or Saturday. Wait, thurs Thursday, I did something then nothing on Friday and hardly anything on Saturday. And then I just reposted or just picked up sales today. Um, so, um, so that's, that's what it is. Um, we got a decent chunk of BOE sales this week. How much did we get in BOE sales? Uh, about 900k. So we might actually be approaching profitability in that market. Um, we can we can check that out quickly. We're now negative uh, 270,000 gold. Uh, so just a couple more sales and I'll have made money from BOEs. I don't remember how many I still have. 
Um, some of the ones I have will definitely be end up end up selling at a loss. Um, and I think I should have invested more in that market if I wanted to um, to end up making gold from it. If you look at my uh, at drainer here, currently it's still sitting at five million. So I mean, on the auction house, we have a very healthy auction house uh, stack. But obviously, my sales this last week just one point nine million. Uh, but at least the gold is increasing and if we look at like my all-time graph it's still trending upwards and um, at this point we should gold cap uh, in about one and a half week uh, so that's going to be nice um, it's a pretty good gold cap like go going from one million to gold cap in um, on, uh, one wait one two in about three months that's not bad at all that's not bad at all. I've never done it that fast ever, so <laughs> that's pretty efficient. Um, and I have a bunch of stuff that I'm not even trying to sell. It's uh, sitting in my bank. I have a bunch of ATVs in the bank, for instance, because I think that the current price is too low, too low, because I can't find monolite ore, and that's just what it is. So, um, so yeah, um, I just expect to. I'm gonna try to invest some more gold next week, um, because I need to increase my sales, like. My sales have gone down. My sales this week is just 3.2 million. And I generally have about 20-30% profit margin. Uh, which would be somewhere in the 600k range. 6-700k profit per week. And at that rate it's going to take me a long time to get to 100 million. So I need to increase that. Of course this week like the effective profit margin was uh, 1.6 million. But I don't know what my actual profit margin on stuff I sold was. And this means I sold more than I bought for sure. And uh, long term, that's going to decrease my potential sales. So what I need to do, um, I need more stock. I do need more stuff on my other realms. Uh, probably also on Draenor, like I need to find more markets. I've started doing enchanting, but it's not, not moving a lot of gold. Um, but next week, I want this number to be bigger for sure. That's like my main priority. Has to be to get more sales uh, across my realms. And uh, hopefully we can get these at least up uh, to where I can start spending some more gold here. Um, it's going to be very helpful if I can start buying pets on Twisting Nether. I am not, I'm not sure if I want to stay on Twisting Nether. We'll see. Um, I generally don't think that my flipping approaches should work too well on like a super high pop realm. But we'll see. We'll see. Um, and um, yeah. So um, if I can get some more battle pets some more items out onto the auction house then that's going to be um, that's going to be the main priority and that should in turn give us more sales over a week uh, probably I want to try to get in at least one more one or two more reposting sessions as well because I did stack this week and skip like three days or something and I lost another day due to the fact that I reposted too late at night so the next day I was just collecting auctions and not reposting uh, because I, I can never be bothered doing cancelling if they're like an hour until my auctions expire. Um, but if I do that, then um, we should be pushing ahead in the right direction again in terms of sales. And uh, I mean, everything is, is looking pretty good outside of, uh, outside of the decrease of my main realm. Everything is looking pretty good, so I'm, I'm not too concerned at all. Um, but we do have to work... Uh, a little bit harder um, on on the sales side of things so so yeah that's um, I think that's about it for this week hopefully you enjoyed this uh, series if there's something you think I should cover or that I didn't look into then do let me know uh, definitely want to try to get make these as, as good as they can be uh, if you like the series make sure you like uh, the video and subscribe to the channel so um, so it helps uh, other people find us as well and uh, yeah, guys, hopefully you have a profitable week just like I did, and uh, I'll see you in a week.